we are looking very strongly at how we are going to help stimulate, catalyze, whatever you want to call it, our primary industries to really start moving swiftly towards things like um, a, a higher use of robotics, a higher use of AI and so forth. Not to put anybody out of work, but if you can take that person who's making $12 an hour and you can upskill them in a higher technology so they're making 16, 17, um, that, that, the math speaks for itself, we all know that. But what we're really trying to say to our employers is this is an opportunity. That's something that I think our companies are very uh, interested in hearing right now because one of the big hits that everybody's taken over the past six months has been in productivity because of the need to take on other things, whether it's cleaning or distancing or so forth. We've seen productivity slips in, in very real practical ways. Uh, and companies are trying to figure out how they can be more productive and get more productivity out of their employees. That's an obvious opportunity for us to say to them, here are ways, here are best practices, here are some potential resources for you to tap in to do it. And very importantly, here's what your goal is. Your business model will become far more stabilized and you'll have the technology available to compete for these contracts, for these onshores, et cetera. This is very much a work in progress, but it's occupying a lot of our time right now, not just to, go to uh, do online searches, obviously that's part of it, but we need to know what we're talking about. We can't just run around to our companies to the extent you can run around today and say, do AI, do robotics. You need to know more about it than that. So you need to educate yourself. And our br &E guy, myself and others, we are spending a lot of time trying to figure this stuff out, not from the standpoint of being experts, but from the standpoint of being able to say to, Company X, here is who you can call, here is who you can talk to, and having enough of a working knowledge so that your credibility, again, is protected and more to the point, you're making an impact with that company. Uh, we, as economic developers, the day has long gone, and it's been gone for a long time, where we could simply sit there and hand out a brochure and say, here's our brochure and here's our incentives, and I mean, that's, that's gone. We need to be value add to our companies and what it is they're looking at right now. So. The main focus, uh, I won't say it's on BRNE because that tends to conjure up certain images in people's minds. Our main focus is on partnering with our industries so that we can walk hand in hand into tomorrow and what that means for them. 